So imagine you have a court and you want the camera to show only the boundaries of the court. Your field of view for the court is going to be different based on resolution and screen ratios. So if you're on an iPad, your field of view is going to be wider than if you were on, say, an iPhone. So how do we fix this? What we're going to do is we're going to build a script that zooms in based on your screen ratio so you'll always see the edges of the court. So then to explain, I've opened up my game Jock Dummy in Unity. Now my objective is to have my game view zoom into the edges of my rink. I can do this manually by selecting my camera and then adjusting the orthographic size in my inspector. Although the problem is that different screen ratios have different visible widths requiring a new orthographic size for every device. So before we begin coding, let's talk about what orthographic size is. To calculate orthographic size, you simply divide your desired height in world space units by two. So say you have four objects, each one unit by one unit stacked on top of each other. The boundary of these boxes would be four units high by one unit wide. If I wanted my camera to zoom in to fit the height of these boxes, my orthographic size would be two. So then say if our boxes were flipped on its side and we wanted the width of those boxes to touch the edges of our screen instead of the height, how would we do this? The formula for this is a little bit more complicated. What you need to do is first multiply the width of our boxes by our screen height. Then take that number and divide it by our screen width. And then lastly, we divide that number by two. Now I know that sounds a little complicated, so let's jump back into Unity so I can show you how that looks in our code. The first thing we want to do is create a new C Sharp script by right clicking in our project window, clicking create, and then C Sharp script. Let's go ahead and label this file camera script. Now the first thing we want to do is get rid of our update function because we won't need that for this, this script. Next, we need to find the boundaries or width of our rink. So let's go ahead and create a new public reference for our sprite renderer. And let's just label this rink. Then let's go back into Unity and drag our script into our camera. And then let's drag our rink sprite into our public reference in our inspector. Now if we go back into our script, let's go ahead and take our formula from before and let's calculate our orthographic size. Using our public reference, we can use rink.bounds.size.x to find the edges of our rink. Then all we have to do is set our camera's orthographic size to equal the value of our formula. Now if we go back into Unity and press play, we should see our camera zoom in or out so that the left and right edges of our rink fit to the container of our device. Even if we adjust our aspect ratio and then press play, it should still have the same effect. Now what if we wanted to do the same thing, except have the top and bottom edges of our rink fit to the container of our device? All we would have to do is adjust our formula to equal half of the rink's height, or in this case, rink.bounds.size.y divided by two. And then when we test this in Unity, we should see our desired results. What if we wanted our rank to always fit on screen despite our orientation or aspect ratio? Currently, our rank is cut off on certain screens, which could affect the gameplay for certain games. We might always want to show our rank. So how can we adjust our script 
so that the rink is completely in view when the scene is loaded. First, we need to calculate our screen ratio. Then, the ratio of our rink. Then, we check to see if the ratio of our screen is greater than or equal to the ratio of our rank. If it is, we're going to use our current formula. And if it's not, then what we need to do is calculate the difference in size by dividing the target ratio by the screen ratio. And then we take our current formula and multiply it by our difference in size. Now, no matter what our screen orientation or our screen size is, the camera will always fit to the edges of our rink. So our rink will always be in view.